Hey folks, it's uh, Sunday, April 19th, and uh, Jake and I are walking out to a trout pond I've been looking at for a couple of years. The uh, state came in and reclaimed the pond, which means they dumped a chemical in there that takes all the oxygen out of the water and kills off all the invasive bait fish and everything. And then they give it about a year or whatever and come back and restock it with nothing but brook trout, in this case. And uh, I've been wanting to come out and check this pond out for a while. And I actually did a few days ago walk out here with the dog. I came in from the other side, which was about a three mile walk each way. And uh, it looked really nice. I didn't bring a fishing pole with me that day. So, Jake, oh, there's turkey tracks and coyote tracks. Anyway, Jake and I are walking out. We've got a, this pond's artificial lures only. So that means you can use lures or fly fish it, which I normally would be fly fishing, but today we're just gonna walk out with spinning rods. Oop, there's some mud. We're gonna walk out with spinning rods and just try to fish offshore and see what's going on. And if it turns out good, then we might come back out with a canoe one of these days, but we get a little bit of a walk. We don't really know where we're going coming in from this side, so we're using Onyx to find our way but it looks like it's about half the walk that it was the other day coming from the other side, so I'm gonna check it out. Hopefully get into some brook trout today. Hello, turkey. He sees us. Big old gobbler up there. He's moving now. I saw his red head sticking out there. That's the only way I saw him. Jake and I made it up to the pond here and uh, I've we've been here about 15 minutes probably and I've lost one and had a couple bites since then but I'm gonna move down the shoreline just leech, like leech yeah I'm gonna move down the shoreline a little bit here and try it out it gets pretty deep right off the shoreline so hopefully we'll be able to catch something right offshore there are a couple guys out there one's fly fishing one's got a spinning rod out in the canoe, which I think next time we come up here, I'm gonna probably bring a boat with me. Well, like I was saying earlier, this pond was supposed to have been reclaimed a few years back, but I just saw a bunch of tiny bait fish, I think. I'm not sure if they were shiners or baby brook trout, but there was a lot of them. I'm assuming that they're probably shiners, which kind of sucks. Somebody would dump those in here, but I'm not getting any bites over here. I'm going to head back over by Jake, and it's the only place I've had any action, so I guess I better try it out there again. Well, we gave it a shot. We uh, <coughs> tried right offshore there. We didn't have a boat with us today, so. I had one little brookie on about 10, 12 inches and lost him. And then I had a few more bites and uh, that's what I was using as a cast master. And Jake had a little spinner on and once I had that fish on and lost him, uh, had a couple more bites. Jake switched over, but we didn't get any action after that, and there was a couple guys out on the pond. One of them had a spinning rod, and the other guy had a fly rod, and I didn't even see them get a bite or catch anything, so we're going to get out of here, hike out, back out to the Jeep, and 
we might hit a lake or two on the way home and fish offshore and see if we can get into something. Um, I've been using this lure for the last week or so and I've actually caught a few nice fish with it. And We're going to stop by the lake on the way home and see if we can get into some brookies or browns offshore. We'll see what happens. Thank you. 